Today, we will discuss how to differentiate between myocardial infarction and aortic dissection based on their clinical presentations. Chest pain is a common presentation in clinical practice, and its causes can range from benign to life-threatening. Two conditions that require immediate attention are myocardial infarction and aortic dissection. These conditions share some overlapping features, but differ significantly in their history, clinical features, and physical examination findings. Historical features. The onset of chest pain and myocardial infarction is often gradual and may be linked to physical exertion or emotional stress. Patients typically describe the pain as pressure, squeezing, or fullness. The pain may radiate to the left arm, jaw, or back. Associated symptoms include sweating, nausea, and shortness of breath. These features are important for identifying potential cases of myocardial infarction. In contrast, aortic dissection presents with sudden and severe chest pain. Patients often describe the sensation as tearing or ripping. The pain reaches maximum intensity within minutes and may migrate as the dissection progresses. Anterior chest pain is more likely with involvement of the ascending aorta, while back pain is more common with descending aorta involvement. These distinct characteristics help differentiate aortic dissection from myocardial infarction. Clinical features. Myocardial infarction is more frequently observed in individuals with risk factors such as hypertension, diabetes, and hyperlipidemia. On an electrocardiogram, ST segment changes indicative of ischemia are commonly seen. These findings provide critical clues for diagnosing myocardial infarction. Aortic dissection is strongly associated with hypertension and connective tissue disorders, such as Marfan syndrome. Neurological symptoms may occur due to compromised blood flow to the brain. Limb ischemia is another possible complication. These clinical features highlight the systemic impact of aortic dissection. Physical findings. During physical examination, Vital signs in myocardial infarction may show tachycardia and hypertension. However, hypotension can occur in severe cases. Cardiac auscultation may reveal abnormal heart sounds or murmurs, depending on complications such as heart failure or valve dysfunction. In aortic dissection, blood pressure discrepancies greater than 20 millimeters of mercury between the arms are significant indicators. Pulse deficits may also be noted in extremities if major arteries are involved. Signs of heart failure or a diastolic murmur may be present if the aortic valve is affected. These findings are essential for differentiating aortic dissection from myocardial infarction. To summarize the differences, myocardial infarction typically has a gradual onset with pressure-like pain that radiates to the arm or jaw. Associated symptoms include sweating and nausea. Vital signs may show tachycardia, and pulse examination is usually normal. Electrocardiogram findings often show ST segment changes. Risk factors include hypertension, diabetes, and hyperlipidemia. In contrast, aortic dissection presents with sudden onset and tearing pain. Pain may be located in the anterior chest or back. Associated symptoms include neurological deficits and limb ischemia. Blood pressure discrepancies greater than 20 millimeters of mercury between the arms and pulse deficits are notable findings. Electrocardiogram findings are often nonspecific and can mimic myocardial infarction. Risk factors include hypertension and connective tissue disorders. Conclusion. Accurate differentiation between myocardial infarction and aortic dissection is essential for appropriate management. A high index of suspicion, prompt ECG, and timely imaging, such as aorta CT, are necessary for confirming the diagnosis and initiating treatment. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to our channel by clicking the subscription button. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below in the comments section.